It's dramatic video as a man and his wife get into a high-speed chase with a suspected child kidnapper. He just blew through a red light. He's blowing through red lights. He just started blowing through every single red light. It started when this 11-year-old girl was abducted on her way home after getting off the school bus in Springfield, Massachusetts. The surveillance camera caught a blue Honda following her. A statewide Amber Alert was issued. On Twitter, cops ask everyone to be on the lookout for the blue Honda. Yes, it's, it's, him. it's him, it's him, it's him. They're certain they've spotted the suspect. They're doing 100 miles an hour. I said, yo, babe, that's that car. Benny Correa and his wife Amanda Disley say they got close enough to see the face of the hoodie-wearing driver. I saw his complete face. Um, he threw the hood back over his face. They call 911 and give police all the info. I'm at Homestead Ave. They're trying to lose me. They're trying to ditch me. The kidnapper. There's a kidnapper. Yep. State troopers at a highway work zone on the Massachusetts Turnpike funneled all traffic into a single lane. And when traffic came to a crawl, they spotted the car. You want to just grab him right here? We'll stop him. Little Charlotte Moshe was found safe in the back seat. Confirming you have that female. Confirm Charlotte was found six hours after her abduction. <laughs> This was the joyous scene as Charlotte's family learned she was okay. The 24-year-old suspect, Miguel Rodriguez, pled not guilty. A judge ordered a mental health evaluation. After the hearing, the prosecutor praised the public response, especially Amanda, for making that 911 call from the car. There was one person who was really, you know, sort of an un unsung hero at this point, who saw this car, followed it, and was able to alert police to that, and which really led to this car being stopped. It's him, it's him, it's him.